Hey, Bola Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, I have a featured seller video here. And this guy is a YouTuber. And he is, let me pull that up. I'm going to show you. He's new to YouTube. So you guys, let's show him some support and go subscribe. It is a reseller channel. And I'm going to pull this up real quick. He is Dad Planet, and he only has 21 subscribers right now, but he is very, very new. So it says, raise your kids, build your business, repeat. So he's got what sold videos, five minute bolo here, uh, thrift runs. So basically everything you would expect from a reseller's channel. So go give it a shot, go give it a chance. Doesn't hurt to find somebody else you might like to watch. So I will link a um, link, that's the word I'm thinking of, in the description of the video. You can find it there or you can just go into YouTube and type in Dad Planet. And he has some really good bolos. And the funny thing is he lives about 45 minutes from where I live. And I'm going to be like trying to figure out which Goodwills he goes to. <laughs> I'm going to be like, can you tell me where you're sourcing? Because you're finding really good bolos. No, I'm kidding. Like where he lives is an area that has tons and tons of Goodwills. So um, lots of Goodwills. But I don't know. Like I don't find tons of bolos at the Goodwills. I did find a doll and she has a bid for $199.99. And I got her for $12.99 at the Goodwill. So that's like one of my better bolos from the Goodwill. But I'm going to keep hunting. All right, let's get started with um some really good bolos are you guys ready for this are you ready for this all right here we go the first item is this hartman tweed duffel bag and are you ready for this he picked this up at the goodwill for six dollars and 29 cents and he sold it for 100 dollars Hartman Tweed Classic Duffel Bag. Now, I will say that the MSRP on this is $475, but this bag, I don't believe it's, it, it's pre-owned and it's missing the shoulder strap, but it's still a very expensive bag. Oh, wait, it does have the tags. Wow, what a good find. That's a fantastic find at the Goodwill. It looks really nice. So anyway, Hartman, be on the lookout for Hartman. The next item is this toaster and Dualit, D-U-A-L-I-T is how you spell it. And it's a two slot slice toaster. I'm guessing it's vintage. It sure looks vintage. If it's not vintage, then maybe it's just made to look kind of, I don't know. What do you guys think? Vintage? Let me see if he put any info down here. Nope, pre-owned toaster. Nope, so maybe it's vintage or it's just meant to look kind of vintage. But anyway, he got this at the Goodwill for $5.99 and he sold it for $54.99 in the buyer paid shipping. The next item is this Bottega, Bottega, B-O-T-T-E-G-A, Veneta. Oh my gosh, I don't know what the third word is. Intrasecado. And interest uh, sorry guys i don't know it's some fancy purse but um it's a crossbody it's a gold woven crossbody and it does say that the exterior is stunning but the interior has some dry rot so um i'm trying to see if i can see a picture of the dry rot oh okay yeah so it's um it looks like it's kind of flaking which i'm not sure what causes that but this must be an expensive brand. So, um, let's see. A friend gave this one to him and said they would split the sale. So basically a consignment deal, 50, 50 split. And he sold it for $199. So yeah, this just must be something I know nothing about. I am not a high end purse type gal, but, uh, I'm definitely going to look for this brand. Did you guys see the tag? I'm going to zoom in for you, see if we can get a better look at that. Bottega. So pretty interesting. Uh, comment below if you've heard of this brand. I want to see how many people have heard of this brand. 
The next item is this Christopher Dahl's um, Country Wear Green Tweed Jacket. It's a 48 regular. Uh, he got this at the Goodwill. He paid $7.99 for it, and it sold for $75 plus shipping. So it looks like he took a best offer on that one, but that's still, you know, $75 on a $7.99 purchase is pretty great. So there you have it. The next item is this Monster High doll. And I guess it's the Wear Cat. And I guess she's rare. So here's what she looks like. And I have one listed right now that I got at the thrift store. And I have mine priced high, but I don't think I have it quite at 50. But he got this for $8.99 at the Goodwill. And it sold for $49.99 plus shipping. If you see these Monster High dolls, especially new in the box, uh, scan the SKU. And if you can't find the SKU, there should it should tell you like a name that you, there you go, Tora, Torelli or something, Torelli, and daughter of the, of the Werecat. So you can look them up pretty easy. The next item is this airplane. It's a model airplane, uh, Balsa. And it says Cub Kit. So I'm going to just zoom in so you guys can kind of see what it looks like. Um, and then here's what it... I'm a little bit close. Let's back up. So here's everything that's on the inside. It's open, but it's never been used or even attempted to be built. So it's just an open box, new and new open box. He got this for $4.99 at the Goodwill, and he sold it for $134.99 plus shipping. The next item is this little tykes tractor. Oh, it's a train. I almost called it a tractor. Kind of looks like a tractor. So it's a train. How cute is that? It's pretty big, but it has a battery and everything. So it says it works, but it needs a new battery. This he got at the Goodwill. He paid $9.99 for it, and it sold for $149.99, and the buyer paid another $100 to have it shipped. sit and spin and um, has music and lights. I don't know if you guys have seen these. I remember having one of these as a kid. I don't know if I had one or if I, I remember playing on one. Um, but yeah, 1973. How cute is that? Uh, got it at the Goodwill for $3.99 and sold it for $30 plus shipping. All right. These Gucci women's brown leather kitten heel mules, open toe, um, eight and a half size eight and a half. And he's got really good um, shoe descriptive words. I am so bad with like knowing what, like I would know open toe and like kitten heel, like all of that stuff confuses me. Like which one's a block and which one's a, you know, I don't know. I can't think of all the terms right now, but he got these at the Goodwill for $4 and 29 cents. And he sold them for $119 and 99 cents plus shipping. The next item is this vintage 80s one piece snowsuit. He got this at the Goodwill for $2.50 and he sold it for $99.99. And I'm telling you, like my Goodwill seems like it has higher prices than that. But maybe um, I don't really look at clothes. So maybe that's the problem. Or maybe he got it on half off day. That could be. Uh, Demarini, 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 Demarini Voodoo Black Alloy Baseball Bat. And I'm going to spell that for you. It's D E M A R I N I. And it looks, I don't know, it's an interesting bat. It looks big, but maybe it's just the angle that I'm looking at. But definitely look up bats. Uh, some bats can go for big money. This one he got at the Goodwill. He paid $3.99 for it, and it sold for $79.99 plus shipping. Super Soaker, another good one. Um, this one he got at the Goodwill for $3.99 and sold it for $69.99. This is one I have talked about in my Bolo Buddies Facebook group. If you guys are not in my Facebook group, definitely go check it out. And I have a link in the description below. I'm also on Instagram, Twitter, and Pinterest.
The next item, Lego Friends Emma's House. 100% complete with box and manuals. And I'm wondering if he put this together. I am sorry, but I would not have the patience to put it together. Ah! Anyhow, and if I did put it together, I would be asking a whole bunch of money because it would probably take a ton of time. Uh, but, or maybe you could hire a kid to put it together. I don't know. Count the pieces. He got this at Facebook Marketplace in a bulk purchase. He got 12 sets, so it averaged out to be about $8, and he sold it for $64.99 plus shipping. The next item is this Kinetti wall clock, and it's, you know, from the 80s, it says Japan. It's kind of a 3D look. Pretty cool looking, actually. Uh, got this for $2.99 at the Goodwill and sold it for $59.99 plus shipping. All right, you guys, I love this one. I love vintage Halloween. So this is Department 56, Legends of Sleepy Hollow, and it's a church, and he bought this. Are you ready for this, you guys? Facebook Marketplace, a bulk purchase. He got four sets. He paid approximately $5 for this. Talk about a lucky score. Um, sold it for $299 plus shipping. How amazing is that? All right, the next one is this Redken and Ro Rowinta Steam Infusion Flat Iron Salon Comb Straightener. So this came from the Goodwill. He paid $4.99 and it sold for $249.99 plus shipping. How cool is that? That must be something expensive. I wonder what they retail for. Interesting. The next item is this Dell Optiplex, and it's an 8 gig RAM. I don't know what all of that means, but it's some sort of thing that hooks up to your computer. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I'm guessing you could probably look at the back and put that information into eBay and search and figure out exactly what it is and what it sells for. He got this at Facebook Marketplace. It was a bulk electronics purchase. He paid $300 for all of it. He sold um, this one piece for $249.99 plus shipping. And he's guessing he had about $3 in this item. Here's another really cool one. Hallmark Keepsake Harry Potter. Um, it's a castle ornament from 2013. It has lights and it has sound. And he picked this up at the Goodwill for $3.99 and he sold it for $204.74. How amazing is that? I mean, it's just like a little plastic ornament. <laughs> oh my goodness. Some things just amaze me. The next item is this Garmin GPS 12 handheld personal navigator, 12 channel receiver, and waterproof. He got this at at the Goodwill for $3.99 and sold it for $129.99 plus shipping. So we are going to go into his, excuse me, his store, Deals Galore USA. And you can see here it's Dad Planet. We're just going to kind of take a look at some of the other things he has listed. And if you guys see something that interests you, uh, go ahead and check down in the description and you can go in and check it out. Some of his items, it looks like he has best offer. Other items do not. <clears throat> and yeah, he's got lots of cool stuff. Lots of shoes. And I actually saw in his thrift haul, one of his videos where he picked up that Ralph Lauren sweater. So very, very, very cool store. All right, you guys, I'm going to skim through a few more of these. Again, if you're not in my Facebook group, definitely go check that out. My links to all of my stuff is down in the description also. And the links to um, his YouTube channel and his eBay store are down below. And I think he's on, I know he's on Instagram, but I think it's the same name, Dad Planet. I think you can find him that way. So you can go check him out on Instagram also. Another Monster High. 
All right. Well, thank you all for being here as always. Again, it's Dad Planet. And by the time I post this, it'll be a little while before I post it because I have quite a few people ahead of him, but I'll be interested to see how many subscribers he has by then. It's pretty cool. So you guys definitely check him out. Tell him Bolo Buddy sent you in the comments of one of his videos. That would be awesome. Just helps us kind of track how much, um, how much, uh, what do you call it? When people hear about something and then they go and check it out. I don't know. It just helps us track it. So it's kind of neat to see. So thank you guys for being here. Thanks for watching. And I'm getting ready to go do my live show at 10 every Wednesday nights at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I have my Bolo Buddies live show. And basically it's a um, participation style. If you come and leave a Bolo in the chat, I pull it up and we look it up. It's kind of fun. So if you haven't been to a live show, definitely come check us out and you can check out one of the replays. They're fun to watch the replays also because there are so many Bolos shared Last week, I mean, the bolos that people shared were amazing. So go check that one out. And thanks for watching. Have an awesome night. And I'll see you guys real soon. Please like, comment, surprise. Let's try that again. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching. Have a good night.